hello everyone welcome back to my channel today we have luxury unboxing video so i'm going to unbox one of fendi's most iconic bags the baguette this is my second bag from the fashion house i've uploaded a video of my first fendi bag which was the peekaboo mini celeria and that was last year so i've added a link to the video in the description box below for your convenience if you are interested and of course i also have some jewelry pieces from ideal which i'm super excited about so everything will be in the description box below as well this is going to be a continuous thing where we talk about luxury fashion lifestyle so don't forget to subscribe if you haven't done so and turn that bell on for new videos now let's jump right into the unboxing first i want to unbox with you a package i received from a company called ideal this came very recently and I'm excited to share with you what's in the box. I already have an idea because I've seen their website and I love their jewelry collection. Their concept and fair prices, but high caliber jewelry. Ideal is an ethical brand using lab grown diamonds which are real. They're not fake or artificial. You know, lab growns are said to be sustainable alternative to natural diamonds, which is interesting to me because it's my first time with such and ideal also uses 100 percent conflict free and traceable 14 karat solid gold so it will not oxidize or discolor and can withstand everyday wear the packaging is really nice and neat with notes which i do love as it feels very personal and special oh wow we have two pouches in here we'll see what's in this one first this pouch is great for travel as well for the jewelry and of course for your travel beauty essentials oh it's a scrunchie love it love the color and this is very useful because i have a long hair and of course we have a what's this mirror yes i can take this every time i go out and of course in this cute pouch is a small box like a tiny book so cute We also have these little cards that can help you play around with the jewelry that is so nice and of course this card is the certificate of authenticity they have two years warranty period and that is amazing I love that these fine jewelry pieces are handmade with excellent craftsmanship and modular. Modular meaning interchangeable or versatile since you can create endless combinations with these pieces. Same base, different add-ons. I'll show you how. I have a stud, a simple one which I can wear for a simple everyday look.
and if i want it a little bit different i will just attach this add-on and i have an elevated or dressed up look You can also attach the base or stud to this add-on and it will become a dangling or drop earring. How smart is that? I really love these pieces. The diamonds are very sparkly. You can wear the jewelry in the shower, to the gym. Really great for everyday wear. You will definitely see me wearing this uh, beautiful pieces. So if you are interested, I recommend checking them out in the website. Everything will be down in the description box. So thank you so much, Ideal, for letting me experience this stunning jewelry. I really, really love them. I love how dainty they are how timeless they look very classy so once again thank you so much ideal on to my new fendi handbag <laughs> yay i can't wait to open and use this you guys so let's just go ahead and open it <laughs> beautiful isn't it this is really cute so the newest handbag in my collection is the mini baguette in the zuka print i think the zuka print is an amazing style for this size i love the fff thing on this tiny bag because a larger size in zuka print is too loud for me this mini bag has a big original clasp as you can see, which looks great with this mini size. Uh, this iconic mini baguette is made of brown chocolate fabric with block embroidery. It has no coating, so it appears to be black, but it's actually dark brown. I do like the color combination and there's nothing quite like it in my collection. So we have here a card and I think this is the authenticity card. So it offers a front flap with magnetic closure and lined with an internal compartment with pocket, just a small pocket like so. It's a pretty small piece, but it can hold a lot. Even your Pro Max phones can actually fit it because I've tried this in the store and that's a plus for me the hardware is gold finish and really really beautiful i do love that oh, this is very tight so this is the strap combination of chain and shoulder pad like the body of the bag which is zuka print this chain is a little bit heavy but because of the shoulder pad right here won't dig uh, onto your shoulder that much and i also love that the top handle and the chain strap are detachable if you detach this one you can use it as a clutch the chain strap is a lot longer for my height 
but I managed to find a solution for this to shorten it and I'm gonna show you how Voila. So there you go. Isn't that amazing? But of course, you have to take the top handle out first before you do that. Really nice. <laughs> Love it. Some like to wear it as belt bag as well. I picked this piece for many reasons. Number one, it is durable because it's canvas or it's a fabric uh, non-coated canvas. And number two, it's super versatile. You can carry by hand, worn either on the shoulder or crossbody as a clutch and like I mentioned, as a belt bag because of the size. It's not just perfect for every day, but for evening or night out as well. The chain and this gold clasp dresses up the bag, so you can definitely wear this for dinner or events. And it dresses up your most plain boring outfit. So it's Fendi's most famous and iconic piece designed in 1997, but it hasn't lost its luster. So I think it's worth the price. Love, love it. So let me know what you think about this piece because I'm sure some of you will ask me why I didn't choose the leather version. Well, price-wise, they are the same. The Zuka print and the leather, which was a surprise to me, but the SA could not offer an explanation as well. So it's just that I really love this bag. That's why I decided to buy it. And besides, I didn't like the colors. Uh, available at that time for the leather version and i think they have pink turquoise black white green and a fuchsia or like a pink hot pink uh, color but i was really drawn to this material and uh print so yeah that's it guys thank you so much for watching i hope you've enjoyed so don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and also comment below videos you want to see. I'll try to do it for you next time. I'll see you soon. Bye.